Oh, hey, don't worry, I'm not doing anything weird. Uh, just using my, my assistant here. Not sure if it's a, a guy or a girl, I just call her Andy. You know, what I'm actually doing is I've got a new manual focus lens, so I can't use my iPad app to set focus on myself. So I've got this little mannequin head here, 20 bucks. I can put it here, I can kind of turn it to the side, check that focus, you know, that the focus is, is, uh, is good in the areas that I want. I can even set up my lighting. So it's actually really simple. I get this mannequin head, I just stick it on, it, you can stick it on anything. I'm sticking it on a tripod, but you could use a mic stand or probably clamp it somehow. Just You just need to get it kind of where your head is gonna be. So my head, when I stand at this table is about here. So I just kind of put Andy at the, about the same, same level. And then I'm able to get behind the camera and I'm able to adjust focus, but then I can set my lighting. So if I want a little darker on this side and a little brighter on this side, I can, I can use it to set exposure. I can see how the shadows fall. I don't know, I mean, I think it's the best 20 bucks I've ever spent because I'm often moving my camera around and, and I, I can't ever trust that the focus is dead on. And you know, even if I'm manually focusing in the last session, I always redo it because maybe the camera moved a little bit. Um, same thing with lighting, you know, they, these do, these lights I have do remember the setting they're on, but you know, it's good to kind of set the lighting every time just in case. You know, if you flip them on and it looks good, great. But this thing can really help you, especially if you're moving around, maybe you, you know, maybe you're going to move your setup around. So you can use this to get an idea of what's dark, what's light, kind of how the shadows fall, that kind of thing. I recommend getting Andy, getting yourself a cheap light stand or a tripod or a mic stand or something like that. Set it up and I think it's going to take a lot of the burden off of getting your focus and your lighting all set up for your in-studio shots. Go grab one. Um, by the way, it does come with this little clamp, which isn't really good enough for what we're doing because it's not quite tall enough. But that's what it does come with. It's kind of this thing like this. So if you could rig something up that this could clamp onto, that would work. But it doesn't have a lot of rotation, only a little bit. But uh, 20 bucks and I'm sold. Thanks, Andy. You're welcome. All right, till the next time. See ya. I said see ya.